Hey, it's Brickzar. And we're going to look at a vintage set. It's a little set. And it's a little uninteresting set. But it's a basic universal building set. It's at 1607. It is 26 years old. It's from 1987. And it's just a little helicopter. It doesn't really have a name on it. Uh, it's a little promotional set, I do believe. Um, can't find any information about the box. Probably was in a poly bag or in some sort of giveaway. This set contained 26 pieces and it's all pretty much basic elements. It does have a black helicopter ro rotor there. You have the tail rotor. It spins if you push it. It's interesting how they designed it. They got this little piece sticking out over here. I'm not sure. It's not really symmetrical when you look at it. has a couple of slopes just all basic elements only 26 pieces all of them very common so this set even though it's 26 years old you can probably still find it for a dollar or two uh, at the most I wouldn't pay more than that so just a, a simple common set uh, Lego made these little promotional sets and they still do They're, I think the ones today are a little more interesting occasionally you get a minifigure have smaller elements I think this was designed probably for younger kids between probably 6 to 10 age. But um, and I think it probably was a promotional item. And here's the instruction manual. You'll see down here. And focus on it. It's from 1987. Printed in Denmark by Larson Tinder and here's the sets that were available at the time just gives you a taste of the different themes doesn't really show you many of the sets As you can see the Black Falcons Fortress still available in 1987 there's some cool space sets Technic uh, but you see predominantly on this page it's the basic set so this probably went in line with the universal building sets and was marketed so you get a pamphlet or the back of the instructions more marketed toward that theme if this was a castle set you'd see probably castle featured up on the top or if it was fabuland you'd probably see fabuland featured there so that's the instruction manual so there you have it set 1607 universal building set it's called a helicopter 26 pieces 1987 um, not one that I would recommend just a simple basic set you could probably even build it from pieces you might have in your collection so thanks for watching bricks are stick around Hey, I would like to give a shout out to Lego Hobbit 12 who was thinking just like me and thought I should maybe give away a vintage set. So that's what we're going to do now. Glad you stuck around. Now, I do have three of these. You may have seen them in a recent haul that I did. And what I want to do is I'm just going to keep one for my personal collection. And since this is a vintage set and it's rather small, I know it's not that interesting, but I would like to just give this opportunity. If two people want it, I'll send it to you. So I'll do a, a giveaway. I'll give away two of these sets. One, um, you'll get one set, and I'll send it to a randomly selected person. Um, please comment below a reason why you'd want it. Now, if your comment is just general comment, that may not be acceptable. I just say why you want this set because sometimes I don't think people watch the videos I know that not all the videos are something that are going to appeal to everybody and this would be one video I'm cer certain that some people probably wouldn't even click on if they saw the image of this set because it looks so uninteresting but if you've managed to watch this long 
uh, suffered through this video, then hey, if you want this set, you can have it. I'll pick two people from the comments below and it'll be given away on June 28th. And I'll put some information in the description too. And I'll put a thing on the on the screen in case a person is hearing impaired where they can uh, look down to the description and find the information. But um, anyway, thanks to um, all my subscribers anyway, uh, especially ones that like the vintage stuff like me. Um, I know it's unusual sometimes. Sometimes it's not even that interesting, but it's just a little piece of Lego history and hopefully the younger guys will see uh, and appreciate what you have today because when I was a kid and growing up in the 70s, um, stuff like this probably would have been a big deal. Oh, it's got rotors. Wow. We didn't have rotors when I was a kid. See, so, um, yeah, I appreciate the details that you have today, especially with the minifigures and uh, even the smaller pieces and the really cool designs. And, um, you know, for the time, some of these sets, they were really uh, advanced. <laughs> but so this is just my little monologue there for a minute. But anyway, please comment that you would want it. Please like the video and be a subscriber. And in June 28th, I will select two people to send this to. And it doesn't matter where you live in the world. Anyway, thanks for watching, Brigzar. Thank you.